Is that really the behavior of a friend? I didn't criticize uh, the Prime Minister. I have a lot of respect for the Prime Minister. The only thing I ask of Theresa is that we make sure we can trade. There will be no limit to the possibility of us doing trade deals around the rest of the world once we leave the European Union. Uh, we go into the meeting with a tremendous meeting that we had with NATO. So certainly it was testy at the beginning, but at the end everybody came together and they agreed to do what they should do. I don't think you'll have any, uh, gee, I did it, I did it, you got me. There won't be a Perry Mason here, I don't think, but you never know what happens, right? But I will absolutely firmly ask the question. There's a uh, psychological benefit and there's a military benefit. Uh, there's also a benefit not to do it. I mean, I was prepared to do things that would have been somewhat harsh. And I think they better watch themselves because you are changing culture, you are changing a lot of things, you're changing security. You're... But I do not think it's good for Europe and I don't think it's good for our country. We have a proud history of welcoming people who want to come to our country to contribute to our economy and contribute to our society. What is important is that we have a set of rules that enables us to determine who comes into our country. Are you giving Russian President Vladimir Putin the upper hand heading into your talks, given that you are challenging these alliances that he seeks to break up and destroy? I guarantee whoever it is in Russia, they're saying, oh, gee, do we wish that Trump was not the victor in that election. Boris Johnson, I think, would be a great prime minister. I also said that this incredible woman right here is doing a fantastic job. I would give our relationship with the UK, and now, especially after this two days, uh, with uh, your prime minister, I would say the highest level of special. I did give her a suggestion. I wouldn't say advice. And I think she found it maybe too brutal. And if they don't make the right deal, she might very well do what I suggested. I think I'd have a very good relationship with President Putin if we spend time together. We're being hurt very badly by the, uh, I would call it the witch hunt. I think that really hurts our country and it really hurts our relationship with Russia. During the Obama administration, he essentially took over Crimea. I don't think he would have done that with me as president. I, and I've welcomed the meeting with President Putin, but what is important is that uh, the president goes into this as he is doing from a position of strength. She left a lot of people in her wake. She's a, a very smart, very tough, very capable person. And uh, I would much rather have her as my friend than my enemy. I think it's a horrific thing that's being done where you're feeding billions and billions of dollars from Germany primarily and other countries, but primarily from Germany into the coffers of Russia. And how can you be working for peace and working from strength when somebody has that kind of power over your country.